This is a simple demonstration of high and low sensitivity and what it does. This is prior to my carpal tunnel surgery. I want you to notice the ends of my fingers, what they look like. They told me if I'd waited, I would have had to have my fingers amputated. If you don't think that messes with you, so watch. My hand goes over the fire and poof, what happened to my hand? Other than it's getting warm. Did my hand change temperature, really? Do it again. My hand starts off dark, and then when the camera changes to low sensitivity, how does my hand look then? Light. Did my hand really change temperature? What changed? The background, and it went to low sensitivity. How many of you have trained in cold smoke, fake smoke, looking for a heated mannequin or victim? What are you ingraining into a young, impressionable firefighter's mind that a victim will not look like, unfortunately, in a fire? Two rules, background and body temperature. Background, how hot it is? Is the camera high or low sensitivity? And is the victim alive or dead? If the victim's alive or just recently deceased, they are, they are known as an active emitter. Their body's trying to do what, naturally? Regulate temperature, so they will show up dark unless they're buried under something. If they've been dead and dead a while, how are they going to show up if they're not regulating temperature anymore? They're going to blend in with the background because they're just simply a sponge. 